Hey guys, Kevin Runlet with Runlet Law Firm. We're continuing our series on big truck or 18-wheeler accidents, things you need to know, things you need to think about. Um, so today we're going to talk about, well, who's the enemy in these things? Look, we understand these truck drivers, most of them are really good people. They're working hard. They are doing a huge service to us. Uh, when we order goods on certain websites and it comes in the next day, well, that's part of these, these truckers' jobs. Um, however, there is no disputing the fact that 18-wheelers and delivery trucks are involved in accidents every day because that driver may have been doing something wrong. So who is the enemy in these cases? I can tell you right now the enemy is the insurance company. That big business is going to do everything they can to not pay you money if you've been injured or if a family member has been injured or even worse, killed. They're going to do what they can to protect themselves. I promise you that. If you don't have a qualified attorney to really look into these cases and to understand the complexities of them, then they will shortchange you. I promise. That's their job. We're also looking out for those unsafe drivers. There are some out there, and the only thing we can do is bring a suit against them to try to teach others not to do this because it hurts people, and we don't want people hurt. So that's who we're looking at going after, but I want you to know that we support safe drivers. That's a good thing. Something you may not know is that almost every big rig truck, every delivery truck, has insurance to cover injuries. Now, the minimum at this point is about $750,000 in the state of Mississippi. Uh, federal regs um, say that they've got to have that, but a lot of them have more. Attorneys can find out exactly what's there. Um, there's also a situation where uh, it may be a company that has lots of trucks, and there may be far more insurance coverage that may be needed that that insurance adjuster may not tell you about. So each truck has a policy of insurance, and we'll get into this in, to, in another video about how, how the stacking works and multiple trucks within one company that have minimum coverages can be stacked together to cover a significant accident. So the other thing you wanna think about is because there is insurance on almost all of these cases, there is an insurance company who is very interested in what's going on with these cases and if there's an accident, they're gonna send somebody out now. They're gonna have somebody there before you can blink your eyes to investigate this and try to protect themselves. So evidence must be preserved. The best way you can make sure that evidence in these cases is preserved is to have an attorney. So find a qualified attorney, someone who has experience in these type things, knows how to preserve the evidence and protect your claim. I hope this helps. If you like it, hit that like button, subscribe to us so you'll know when new videos come out. We're in a series now about big truck 18 wheeler accidents and things that you need to think about in those situations. Um, so thanks for watching and have a great day.